and Joseph, and it's titled The Skill of Self-Confidence. Um, after listening to him speak, I was inspired to speak on the subject because today, while I was checking into my challenge group, one of my challengers posted and talked about how he um, has lost self-confidence within himself. Initially, when I read his post, I felt really bad for him. Um, but then as I continued to read, I realized I knew exactly how he felt because that's how I was feeling the week prior. I feel like so often we um, make goals or make plans for ourselves, but then once we hit one thing that um, challenges us more than we are used to, then we give up. And so today I want to talk to you about how to persevere through those obstacles and through those challenges and believe in yourself because the only way you will be able to change and to grow is to practice over and over and over again until you become good at that um, thing, whatever you are practicing, whatever you are perfecting because you won't be able to gain that self-confidence until you overcome those objections. Remember that pressure builds diamonds. If you're under pressure or in a fight or flight situation, you have to decide that you are going to be the best that you are going to be. Either you're gonna flight or you're going to fight, so decide to fight and to be the best that you can be. Persist upon your dreams and um, self-talk. You need to have positive self-talk always. In those moments of silence when you're brushing your teeth or taking a shower right before you go to sleep, remind yourself that you are strong, you are capable, you are brilliant, and you can achieve anything you put your mind to. Um, something I have to remind myself these things every single day. Even right now on my um, board, it says, no one will believe in you unless you do. And that's where it all starts. It begins with that belief within yourself. Um, so be serious with your goals and be serious with your dreams. And I promise you, you will be able to achieve them. Be in an environment where you will be continued to inspire others, to uplift others, and to uplift yourself. Do not sound your, surround yourself by those who will put, your, put you down or those who um, think negatively because that environment will affect you um, one last thing before I leave, I want to challenge you to write a letter to yourself. Write a letter to yourself congratulating you on everything positive you have done in your life. All of the accomplishments you've done 